Hey fams, welcome back to my channel. So today is another Christmas in July DIY challenge. I am so excited about it, you guys. So I'm gonna be making a couple of DIYs here today. And my first project is going to be sort of like an art frame um, Christmas calendar, you know, count down the days <laughs> to Christmas. And I'm going to be using a bunch of different paints uh, for the background of this wall art and then I am going to also be using some wood scraps that I have in my garage I did not stain the wood because I just didn't have the time really to do it so I'm using a foam board that I got from the Dollar Tree like I said my wood scraps which are free and then I am going to be just cutting the, the foam board to fit the size of the wood scraps and then going ahead and painting it with this celery paint. Guys, I just wanna thank you all so much for your awesome support during this Christmas in July series. I have had so much fun doing this with you all and just the amount of participation and love and encouragement, it has just been so wonderful and that's what really prompted me to want to go into fall with some more DIY projects because I see that you guys really, really do love um, these challenges and y'all are super creative and talented and so I wanted to give you guys a platform where you can go ahead and showcase your creativity and your awesome and wonderful talented crafts. So thank you guys so much for joining um, me here on this challenge today. It is just so much fun. course she needs no introduction she is my sister from another mister I love her so much oh my gosh we have so much in common and I've just been just enjoying her friendship so much Tamara Wilson from love my babies forever y'all she is super talented and I am so glad that she's co-hosting with me on this Christmas in July DIY challenge make sure you head over to her channel her link will be in the description box below she does a lot of awesome DIYs a lot of home decor y'all some tablescapes the girl is the queen of the blingage and the queen of the tablescapes okay so make sure y'all go ahead show her some love subscribe to her channel double tap the bell so you receive all her notifications and also don't forget to check the playlist that's going to be taking part of all the ladies that's going to be participating in this wonderful challenge this Christmas 
Christmas is mine. So yes, that is my oatmeal, my breakfast. <laughs> and I love doing DIYs in my room. You guys know this about me already. So I'm just going ahead and because I did not stain the frame of the wood, I am just going ahead and using some brown um, paint and painting the wood. And then I'm going to kind of go over it with like some gray metallic paint um, just to kind of give it like a weathered, farmhouse look because obviously that is the style of my home is a modern farmhouse new england style so i am going to be just giving it a uh, just a little wash with the gray paint as well So guys, this is what it looks like. I think it turned out so cute. I've never done any of this before, so it is all new to me and freehanding is new to me, so I'm really learning freehand calligraphy. But this just turned out so cute and I went ahead and used a permanent Sharpie marker. I also made this little tassel out of the same material and just um, like a little green ribbon. And then I just used a red thumbtack, you guys, to stick it into the foam board. And I just think it's so cute just counting down the days to Christmas so now you guys have seen me made my pillows yes and Christmas is no different I am going to be making two different types of pillows or two different styles of pillows rather um, and I am just enjoying this DIY challenge I hope that you guys are too um, if you guys are new to my channel hello and welcome my name is Shoshana I have two channels here on YouTube my first and main channel is the channel that you're watching right now it's Regal Designs by Shoshana and I do a lot of home decors see Seasonal home tours and decor um, crafts and DIYs I also dabble in some shop with me's and thrifting and thrifting haul videos which I absolutely love um, and I upload on this channel every Tuesdays and Thursdays at 12 noon Eastern Standard Time and I also have my cleaning channel which is the cleaning queen and I upload every Mondays when every Mondays Wednesdays and Fridays at 12 noon and over there we are doing so much um cleaning motivations and organization and decluttering and get getting your house in order especially now that the fall season is upon us i am so excited about it if you guys are excited about fall give this video a thumbs up because i'm telling you i am full mode ready for fall you guys um and yeah i am i'm just so excited about this cleaning channel because it's what i love to do is one of my many passions i have kids so i clean anyway so why why not go ahead and help motivate you guys and show you guys some really cool tips and tricks so if you're interested in any of my content on any of my channels go ahead and hit the subscription um, button down below and also double tap on that bell so guys I just love the way that these pillows turned out you know, I'm having so much fun really making pillow covers. Normally, I would sew them, but this hot glue gun thing is really cool. And they just look so nice. I think they look so high-end, so I love them. And the fabric, I got them from Walmart, and they were, I believe, $4 um, for a yard. And I just love them so much. So now, I am going ahead and I'm making some ornaments, some balls or bubbles, I believe, the people in the UK call them. I just love them so much. I'm going to be recycling some um, ornament bubbles or balls that I've had over the years and I'm just going to be giving them some new life and I love this uh, material. It has like a buffalo design on it and then you know my 
plaid material that I've just been using. Um, and it just looks so great on my little tree. And I can't wait for you guys to see the results. They are super cute, super easy to do. Um, let me know down in the comment section if there's anything that you guys are going to be recreating. And this is what they look like. Yes, I am in my new pantry, so you'll see some background stuff in there. But I just love this material. It has the little buffaloes on there, and they're just so pretty and just festive and the red and the greens just scream traditional which is my theme for this year and i am super excited so let me know down in the comment section which craft or diy project is your favorite and if you are going to be recreating any of the projects that i have done today make sure you check out the playlist if you are participating add your videos to the playlist link also check out Tamara's channel everything will be linked down in the description box below thank you guys so much for participating and for coming along with me on this DIY journey I had so much fun and I will see you guys in the fall bye <laughs>